Hello ladies and gents, welcome back to my channel. Um, this is going to be kind of like a Carly Russell kind of part. One, two, three, four, five. And we're on part seven. No, I think we're on part three right now. But uh, you know what? Uh, I'm sitting here and I'm wondering, you know, he, someone trespasses in your house, breaks in, or I would assume he didn't have a key. He got in there. Trespasses in your house, your home, uh, goes up the stairs or wherever. I don't know how their house is situated, whatever she was coming down. He was going up the stairs. I don't know. Grabs the uh, homeowner, occupant of the house, turns her over and a couch and manhandles her, grabs her by the neck, all in the presence of a child. And if there wasn't a child, assaults this homeowner in her house, her house. So I, I'm think, I'm sitting here and I don't know, maybe you guys are wondering with me, maybe you know something I don't, maybe uh, it happened and I missed it. Uh, where's the officers? I mean, now are they going to arrest this dude? I mean, is, look, like, I, I don't know. I'm just at a loss for it. Maybe, I don't know. If somebody comes into your house, threatens you, and actually lives it up, lives out the moment, and does everything they were thinking, and it's on video, I mean, how is he still walking around? I, what? So we're going to get into how a timeline here. This isn't going to be a long kind of thing. I'm going to try. You know I am. I try to. Maybe I talk too much, <laughs> but we're going to get into, uh, that's why this is chill. <laughs> okay. Where did Kiki meet this guy? Where did she meet Darius Jackson? What does he do for a living? Um, some other things I was reading here. So let's just go, let's go into two minutes, far too much. Uh, they met at a Memorial day party. So Kiki Palmer and Darius Jackson reportedly met at a Memorial Day party hosted by, and I hope I say this right, Isa Ray and Diddy in May of 2021. Oh, excuse me. Darius was believed to have been there as a guest of his brother. I know I goofed on this one. Saronis, as the mom said it. So I think it's Saronis. Also, I want to clear something else up. When Saronis was speaking, he was not speaking about his brother. He was uh, responding to the mother speaking about Kiki. This is what he was saying about her. I don't know what Kiki, I don't know her personality. I don't live with her or whatever. I just see her in movies. She's a celebrity. So I can give her character, only God judges. Uh, all I saw is a man break in her house and she has the cameras up and toss her over the sofa and put hands around her neck. So there's no way you can justify that. Anyway, Darius was believed to have Jackson who appeared on HBO, or Sarius, Saronis Jackson, who has appeared on HBO's Insecure, along with Isa and Kiki. They kept their relationship under wraps until August of that year when Jackson made it Instagram official by posting a picture with Palmer. And you notice the first one who made it Instagram official is, uh, is uh, this Darius. He posted the pic on Instagram for all to see he was with Kiki Palmer end quote. Okay. So we're, we're like, what is his motives? You know, what, what did he, uh, you know, some girls and guys who can't be sexist about it say, have uh, go out there, get babies with these superstars that got mega millions of dollars. And they, uh, I think something just happened to that recently with, um, Gosh, what, uh, Tyrese, Tyrese, the singer, Tyrese, and his name comes to fail me right now. I think it's, I don't want to say a wrong name, so that's it, but he's singing the song Sweet Lady and something like that. Tyrese claims is happening to him where is love a contract or something has a song out or something like that. So uh, you see a lot of these people that get with these superstars, all this money, and then they have these babies or get whatever cloud or whatever. And they wind up getting child custody. And it kind of makes you wonder how real 
that relationship, you know, was or whatever to only be, you only in the relationship for like a year and after you have the kid or whatever you get, you know, it's done and we're going straight for the prenup or straight for, you know, what we signed, we get the payoff or whatever. I, you kind of wonder what these relationships are really about. So Darius, um, you know, what did Darius do for a living? What does he do for a living? You know, but I, I find, and, and then on the flip side, when people, some people that are not known are going out with people that are known, they're very quiet about it. They don't um, want to draw attention to their uh, significant other or whatever. They don't want anyone all up in their business. So they can, uh, they're going out and everything like Keanu Reeves' wife. She's very quiet about the relationship, our girlfriend. She doesn't say much about the relationship. And they've been in a relationship for like years. I think it's like five, six years or something like that. But she's not throwing it all over the place for people to see it. So uh, Jackson attended Sparta High School in Sparta, Illinois. He was a two-way football. No, no, no. This is another Jackson. <laughs> Hold on. See, he, that's the national receiver. Because when you do, whoops, sorry. When you, <laughs> when you do two, uh, there's two Darius Jacksons. There's a football Darius da- Jackson. And then there's this guy. So <laughs> this is Darius Jackson. This is what he does. Okay. So Darius Jackson has worked both in the fitness. <laughs> sorry has worked in both uh, where, 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 where are we? Slow to run. Kiki and Joy night with the girls. Okay. Cold shimmer outfit. I'll just pause it. I'll just edit it. Let me see. Find it. I normally go ahead and let you guys ride along with, I don't know what the dude did. I'm researching just like you, but I'm just, you know, bringing about the news or whatever. Okay. Darius Jackson. Fitness. I think he was a personal trainer. That's what I think he did. Okay. Working as an actress. Okay. So we know Kiki has been working as, as an actress in Hollywood since childhood with one of her most recent projects being Jordan Pills. Nope. A star reveals she welcomed the baby with boyfriend Darius Jackson on February. Oh, let's put fitness here. But I think it was her trainer. He was like a, a personal trainer. Let's just put fitness. I want to make this under 10. I don't think he has a long resume. All right, let's just, what did he do? Okay, so Darius Jackson is the jack of all trades. Darius Jackson, that's what it says, has worked in both the fitness and entertainment industry over the years. According to his LinkedIn page, over 19,000 followers have subscribed to his YouTube channel per the outlet where he's touted being an instructor at Inspire Fitness. On the Inspire Fitness website, Darius revealed he played football at Fresno State University on a scholarship. Since my childhood, I got into fitness from playing sports. I always found myself being active since then, he said. The site also claimed Darius was pursuing his career in and received a certificate in broadcasting. Okay, so what was Kiki and Darius meet cute? So let's see here. While both Kiki and Darius appear very private about their personal lives, it has been reported that the couple, remember they first met at that, um, Instagram party. So it all started from what we know with Kiki wearing a very daring dress. Um, hate me if you want to, ladies and gents. I am not criticizing Kiki. She can wear whatever the heck she wants to. She's a grown adult. Uh, I myself would not wear it just because I don't want to, you know, expose myself to anyone other than my husband who I'm with. That's just my opinion. So no, I didn't agree. But although I didn't agree, I didn't say she's this, that, and the other from wearing it. Cause that's her business. If she wants to wear it. Um, I don't know. I just don't see why all the girls, if the, you know, why you would want to expose yourself like that. It's the, 
things I see on the internet. But anyway, uh, moving on to this, Darius deleted all the photos in March, however. He was really mad about that, what happened with Usher and uh, giving her the serenade and her going on stage with him like that. And, um, you know, he, he voiced his opinions over the, uh, the social media to let her know that he was upset about that. And that's another thing. He, he seems to, uh, you know, always want to tell social media what he feels about things when, you know, you, that's between you and your mate. You just don't say, Oh, you know, you cooked those, you got up this morning and you just left and you know, I was sick with the cold and you didn't even give me orange juice or eggs in bed or something. I don't know. And you just walked out and just left me there hanging and out. I'm going to tell Instagram. No, that's, <laughs> it's just not something you do. I mean, if you two are in a disagreement, it would seem like that would be private, right? You, the less uh, stress and everything you don't have to get that from outside strangers that validation is it's between you so we'll look at that we know he was on a scholarship for football um if he made the uh, football and however that goes i'm not really into football but it looks like he if he had made that he would be in a team by now i don't mean anything harsh but i guess that didn't play out so well for him i don't know but um, the fitness instructor, he did seem to maintain that, whether or not he is still there. We don't know. Um, it's called uh, something. I don't know if they still have his, his face on there or whatever. Uh, it's called the Inspire Fitness website. So that's where he was a fitness instructor. But boy, this isn't going to do anything to help him after what happened here. So, um, wow. That's where they first met. We know they first met at the memorial party. We know that Kiki was private from the get-go because she's not she's not doing anything to show this off. Okay. Uh, she in fact she's said uh we want to keep this private under wraps, you know. And and you know, you're just first getting to know someone, you probably don't want to um, you know be like, oh, here he is, because you don't know absolutely if it's going to work out. So you don't want to be like, oh, here he is. I'm just telling love is everything. Oh, the sunshine, the moonlight. You, you know, you're just kind of like, I'm not doing anything with this, you know? <laughs> I just want to keep it and just a little bit, a little bit, a little quiet. Okay, so, but he didn't. So we know he, uh, he showed that picture. On Instagram, we don't know how she felt about that thingy, thingy. What are you? Yeah, hold on a minute. All right. I don't know what that was. But, um, so, uh, wow. That's the first thing. Second thing, he worked at the fitness place, and um, he works around a lot of Hollywood elite. And, yeah, he found Kiki attractive, and uh, she actually gave him the time of day. <laughs> I don't know who else on the track yeah, but she gave him the time of day, you know, cause she's got a, she's not like how much money you have. I don't know if he was thinking that. So they started going out. So there's the timeline, Memorial Day party, Instagram, we're together. And then they're going out and uh, this has been like 21. So this is 23 now. So two years, like she said. And within those two years, um, you know, they had this, um, these incidents where he would, as described in her court order, do atrocious things uh, against her within all of these two years. And uh, finally, this was the end result that had uh, bugged her tether. And she uh, figured now, and she should call the police. That honestly, ladies and gentlemen, for, for safety, for safety, lock your doors. I am still tripping on that one. How the hey did he get in her house? Uh, either, I guess he had a key. I don't know. And she didn't take it away from him or something. That's the only thing I'm seeing. Or her door was not locked. She lives in a good area. I'm always locking my doors, windows. Walls, too, if they got locks. 
hey, you tell me. And, uh, you know, the <laughs> he got in her house. He trespassed, disturbed her beautiful day. And uh, he's walking around saying, I love you, son. I'll see you soon or something to that tune. Yeah. I don't know that. Okay, so anyway, what are your thoughts? You know, you think he should be walking around? You think he's a, a danger? <laughs> Dangerous. What are your thoughts? You let me know. Just a little bit of um, background and foreground on him. And I hope there's no other ground. I really do uh, pray for her and everything. Uh, that uh, she and you know what as bad as it is our Lord tells us even to pray for the enemy I do but uh, I hope that whatever happened there I'm just still I am still puzzled like you guys trespassing in someone's house that's that's point one that same one okay ladies and gents thank you for watching until next time